Hello! Hey guys! I'm Tatiana. I'm Angel. And we're the Makers HQ. Okay, so very quickly, if you've been following with us in the past videos, thank you. And if you're new, we are a married couple who bought a sublimation machine this year. And we're, we just happen to also be artists. And we are testing um, everything that we possibly can on, the sublimation, on this uh, heat press. Um, with sublimation okay so um, we want to thank everybody who's been watching and who's been subscribing oh my God. That's Ex insane. exactly Crazy. we're we're like we can't even so if you do like this video please consider to S subscribing yes and um, that's it so all right today's video is all about a vinyl puff all right, this is Angel's um, preferred. I love that. Yeah, when I saw it, I was like, oh, that's my thing. I wanna, I wanted to try something because yes. it's nice. And we don't know the, how it's gonna come out. We don't really, we didn't even test it. No, we did we, test it. We went with the instructions. That yes. Gave us. Okay, so this is what happened. I want glitter, he wanted puff. So we bought both and we're gonna do a video on glitter, which I am like, poof, poof, poof. I can't even stop. I wish I could glitter everything. But um, when we did the puff, for some reason, we bought it and it didn't give us instructions. So we just followed a bunch of things online and we had to actually call back the company and tell them like, you didn't give us instructions. So nothing was sticking. And I did a tiny test on my own of just like a triangle to see if it stuck and it did. So it's supposed to stick. But in reality, this is a real, the first time that we're actually doing, doing something. something that's not like just a scrap piece of a sleeve <laughs> exactly. or something. A design. Exactly, all right? So um, let's get to it. So because we don't have the um, plotter or the, the cutting machine to cut the vinyls, I decided to make the design by hand. Cut it by hand. Basically. Good old fashioned way of doing it. Yes, this is basically a silhouette of a set of uh, drums, basically. And I printed it out, I cut it out, and then I drew it on the vinyl, and then I cut it again, cut it out again out of the vinyl, and that's how I got the, the design made, but it takes time. This it takes is, a lot of time. It takes a lot of time. So this is mostly if you want to do one or two designs, like to test it out, but it's not recommended to do it for like a no. lot of things because no. it takes a lot of time. It takes a lot of time. And it doesn't look like, I cut it with a, a paper cutter now, yeah. so I don't think it's going to look like, oh my God. And you use a huge pages. one. You didn't yes. use like an exacto. <laughs> no. You use like a box cutter. Yes. So, so that's, yes. that's something. And also, uh, just to note, we don't have, like Anke said, we don't have a, a cricket or a silhouette or any of that. We're considering getting one, so we're doing the research right now. And um, he also added the tiny drumsticks by hand afterwards. Oh yeah. The I drew the tiny, yeah, the star and the drumsticks are after. Um, I created, I made the design and then I, I felt like it was empty. So I added the tiny star in the middle and the two drumsticks on top. So we're going to see how that works. We're going to see what happens. All right. So Okay. So this is what we're going to um, sublimate. We're going to put a design right here. Um, the design is this one. This is the design like this and then it has a tiny star somewhere here the tiny star is gonna be here in the middle and, and the drumstick <laughs> <laughs> and it has the tiny drumstick <laughs> it's all handmade guys so bear with me it's all like cut it by hand so you know it's uh, it's weird but it, it is what it is but okay we, we do we have decided to like be a little bit more ourselves and be more I know. artistic if you don't have the DIY. machine if you don't have the ma if you don't have this machine there is very little you can do about yeah. it but you have we have this machine but we don't have the, no. either a printer or a, a platter so you have to go you have to get creative and yes. even if it takes time but for one time for demonstration purposes it's not gonna 
And it's oh. also to note that it's a little bit different here as well in Buenos Aires because um, I don't know about all everywhere around the world, but in Buenos Aires, like I don't know if it's all South America basically, but here doing sublimation, like getting sublimation paper, things printed is very common for some reason. So mm -hmm. that's yeah. why we even decided to go into it yes. because it was, we didn't have to go and invest so much yes. to start. And we can just go to our printer who's like down the street, who's like 10 minutes, 15 minutes away and get stuff done, right? So we didn't want to invest in a printer until we had to. And then on the other hand, even though it's easier to get like sublimation paper and everything printed, it's hard to buy um, stuff because it's expensive. Yeah, like, like printers, the cricket it's not, yeah, is like cricket is three, four hundred dollars more. Oh, yeah. uh, Everything is like, like twice the, the price. Exactly. So, so we're just like, mm, it's not like you go, until, you know, B&H and you just spend yeah, four hundred dollars. You don't go to Walmart and, and just and get there is stuff. No, yeah, no. So everything is very expensive. So we're going to get it at some point, but this is not the time. Not the time. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So that's it. The other thing, um, I would like to tell you briefly is that, uh, like I said, we're going to be doing a little bit more artistic way and like more DIY because we are both artists and I don't think we mention it in too many videos. And um, I, it, because we're artists, like we do a lot of our own work and we print to do our work, but we haven't been doing it so much on these videos. So now we will be like not focusing, but we will be putting a lot of emphasis on if you are an artist or if you are a designer, the types of things that you can do with sublimation. Cause it's actually, the more we're seeing it and we've been around um, with the machine since February, the more we see how crazy it is and how crazy in a good way, how um, you can do so many things and it's just the beginning. So this, we're doing a straight up test of uh, the puff, but I had seen uh, a YouTuber do a combination of vinyl with puff, which I think is really cool. Mm -hmm. um, we want to do some glow in the dark, the glitter of yes. course. Yes. So we're really going to be playing with the vinyls. I'm mm -hmm. calling it like our vinyl season right now <laughs> because we just discovered vinyl and we're like, <gasps> oh my God. There are so many, and also it's so many names. Oh, the names are ridiculous. The names are not only in English, here we have to translate it in Spanish. Yeah, exactly. Ther therefore it gets like even more complicated. Yeah, everything like is thermo this, thermo that. Okay, so according to the instructions, it's uh, 17 seconds, 100 and, oh, what's the equivalent? And, uh, uh, 165 I, would be approximately 333. Yeah, 333. But I'll, I'll yeah, uh, exactly. do it right here. And also, um, this is according to our puff because we've, I've seen other puffs that were like way lower or mm -hmm. 340 for five, uh, 10 to 15 seconds. Yes. So this is our puff. You have to check with the manufacturer mm -hmm. or at least with the company you bought it from. Uh, because it makes a difference. It won't stick if it's not the right temperature. Mm -hmm. okay. And also the quality of the buff. Yes. Okay. okay. See so you guys. see you in a second. 15 seconds. 17. We're back. Let it, ah! I said leave, it, leave, it, leave it for five seconds. Oh, wow. Do you guys see? Oh, wait, let me take the phone. Let me show you. No. I want to take, I have to peel it now. Yeah, they said peel it hot. I would start with something like this. Oh, wow. Oh, look, this part came uh, off a little bit. Mm -hmm. I think it's too skinny. This oh, one is my coming. tiny drumsticks. Are they coming out? They stay, yeah. They stay, look. I think here is the only thing. Okay. Oh, that's amazing. Oh, wait, there's a star. Oh, the tiny star. <laughs> oh. oh, it came out super nice. Okay, so wait, let me, let me show you guys. Mm. Are you recording? Oh, yes. <laughs> so, I wish you could see the, uh, yes, you can you see can. it. You can, you can see it. Mm -hmm. We. I don't know if it's supposed to be like, well, the thing is that it says that the puffs that I've seen in the past, I feel were smooth, but. I know, it's, I think it's um, the quality that you get. We don't know what quality we got. We just got it. We don't have a, um, a brand here that says, oh, this is the best brand. 
But we're so going to look for a company that actually has like brands. This. We can't tell. I mean, it's super cool. Would I do it again? I'm not, I think I would look for another company. Yeah, I would look for, but can you? Yes. Um, uh, it's super cool. I like it. I really like it. Um, yes, you can. Okay, so the goal here was to make it puffy. Like, yes. To make it boop, grow. Yes. And it did. It did. Now, the texture, I don't know. You might, we might find another um, another um, vinyl that is, has more of a like a soft texture, not so rough. But the goal, other than this tiny part here, I don't know if you can see, this tiny part is loose. But everything else is good. It's like it's not loose. No. It's glued to the fabric, and I actually love my tiny design. <laughs> I well, it, it took me like four hours to cut out this thing. Hours to do oh this my sticker. god! So, what can you do? This is good. Yeah. And then you can play with because oh, because you can do this on any fabric or any a, any anywhere. Like oh, this, yeah, is, this, this is, is cotton. cotton. This is cotton. You can do it on poly. You can do it on any fabric. It will not like um, discriminate. It no. will just stick on anything. <laughs> If <laughs> we just stick on anything, even a piece of wood, you can just glue it on and you don't need poly, poly, yeah. really nothing. It's just, you know, it's like a, like a sticker. Um, so that's the good thing that even if you want to do another, and that's the part that I don't know, if you want to do another design here, let's say, I would just leave this outside the machine. I wouldn't leave it outside <laughs> because the other day I, I tried it yeah, and I what happened is it, it got cold, it got hot. Then I started to want to take come off and it was a disaster. Mm -hmm. But like I said, because we were just testing and I, I was testing like tiny triangles, you know, I just cut a piece of the thing and I was just tuk, tuk, tuk. and um, this part was just it was a mess. It was like, boom, yes. like it just kept coming off, getting stiff. It was weird. This is nice. Uh, this this kind of uh, vinyl is nice for um, this type of designs, cutouts or like shadows and also nice for uh, branding. Like if yeah. you have a word, if you have your label or even anything that you want to write, like small um, and puffy, it looks amazing. Yeah. I think it, it looks really like super it. nice. But again, you have to find your own, uh, try your own uh, vinyls because this one looks rough. It doesn't yeah. look soft. So we wanted something that was, so we're going to go back and get something else. Or We're going to get it from another company. Yeah, from another place. Because this is try and error. It happens to all of us, I guess. Yeah. So... That's, That's it. it. So do we agree with this? Of course. Yeah, hundred percent. Like yes, it? go for it. Yeah, go for it. Just find your own. This vinyl. is a tiny recap that we just did. So I know do it's we fantastic. Like it? Look how nice it looks. It's super cool. I, mean, I don't know. I feel like it looks awesome. Okay, it's and and, and you have different colors. You can do red. You can do any color. I mean, the, this vinyl comes in in a way of different yeah. colors. You do this one on red here. That's really fantastic. Cool. Yeah. So yes, we approve. So we approve. Puff. We approve. Yes. We see you on the way out, guys. Oh my God, so much fun as always. It's always a pleasure to be here. Thank you for being here on our sublimation journey. And um, again, we're very happy when you subscribe. We're very happy for the comments and we love it. We actually have 224 subscribers at this moment. And we're like, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So please uh, continue to love us. Continue to send us good information when mm -hmm. you find something. And we really appreciate it. Yes. Okay. Like, subscribe, and uh, we will see you in the next one. Yep. See you soon.